Hi everybody, um, <clears throat> back again to make another video. Um, I just want to say really up front thank you so much to everyone who's watched the video, commented on the video, good or bad, it's, it's uh, you know, it's not about whether uh, you believe me or not, or any of this, it's just about the discussion. And what they're telling me is that it's not about video, it's not about, although, listen, believe me, I'm with you on that. I want to get great video. I want to get kick-ass video that's amazing, that's, uh, but it's, it's, it's just about the discussion. Um, and by having that discussion, whether you believe it or not, the videos are good or not, uh, that opens the doorway in terms of consciousness, it plants a seed. And, oh look, there we go, there's another hawk. Look at that. There's a beauty right there. I hope you can see that. Anyway, so that, that by doing that, by doing that, it, uh, it plants the seed of, of this whole subject. And consciousness is everything. It's the key to physicality change. It's the key to understanding we're not alone. It's, it's, it's everything. And believe me, I'm no expert at all, not even close. But, you know, what they're telling me is that 99.9.9.9 of the natural world, what we call the natural world, is not the natural world. 99.9.9.9% of the natural physical world is consciousness and energy. And that 1% of a percent of a percent is the physical reality we live in. And, you know, they know I'm a visual person and they've done something really amazing, given me an amazing gift that up until two months ago I didn't have. And so basically, long story short is, you know, up to two months ago, you know, yes, I was seeing the UFOs and the orbs flying out of the UFOs and, and filming and all these different things. But with my eyes, I was seeing those things. But what I've come to learn is there are many different types of orbs and energies and stuff. So basically, I was seeing the UFOs with my eyes and I was seeing the orbs that would come out of those UFOs and visit with me with my eyes but but that was the ex, you know extent of it and and all the other stuff I've described that was the extent of it uh, I wasn't really seeing anything in the house you know or having those kind of paranormal experiences and that kind of thing but basically what happened is two months ago uh, I'm looking out the window of our bedroom at night around 11 o'clock at night at our garden and I start to see these flashes of dark things flying all around in our garden and and that went on for like about a week and then a couple weeks later I, those things turned into hundreds and hundreds of orbs that are not the same orb that I'm seeing with the UFO stuff and those orbs are flying from the garden inside of our house uh, everywhere around me in the house and and then that turned into seeing orbs everywhere in the house, seeing these mist, this mist, uh, smoke, energy that literally looks like uh, long lines of twisting, turning smoke with the orbs uh, flying everywhere, uh, like all over the house, all around me, kind of like you know, 24/7, disappearing, reappearing, like. But it's a 24/7 thing, and then with that. I'm, you know, I started seeing these like pops of golden and red light and green light with sparkles all around them and that went on for a couple weeks and then so basically all of that has turned into now it's a 24-7 thing. So basically what I'm telling you is that if I'm in a room during the daytime or uh, if I'm in a room during the daytime and there's a little shadow on command, I'm seeing all of this stuff. I'm seeing all the golden energy pop, light, red light, sparkles, the orbs flying everywhere, this mist, gold, this, this uh, smoke mist all around me. It's like a, it's like a vapor, but it's conscious. It, 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 it's conscious, and I'll tell you why. So this is now 24-7. So basically what I have to do is I can be 
in normal eyesight where I'm just basically sitting watching TV with my wife uh, at night, let's say. And if I want to shift my consciousness just a little, like do kind of like... Um, kind of like a soft eyes kind of thing, kind of adjust my conscious just a little bit. All of a sudden, poof, I see this like like a mist thing, and I'll see like an orb zip by, and then I see like a little sparkle thing. And then basically when I go to bed at night, when I turn the lights off, whether I adjust my consciousness or not, it, it, they're there. And it's all around me 24-7 till dawn, uh, like I said, during the daytime, if I'm if I'm like riding the treadmill in the morning and I and it's a little uh, dark in the room, they're there. If I, you know, so basically, <laughs> I'm doing this ex experiment every night. So I'll lie down in bed, and all of this is going on, and and basically I'm seeing uh, I'm seeing orbs everywhere. This mist, smoky stuff everywhere in front of me, kind of circling around my face. Do Look, there's a there's a hawk right there. Look at that, it's beautiful. And uh, like dots of golden like light going pop, and then like sparkle, and like and it's everywhere. It's everywhere. It's 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 all around me. And so basically, I'm sitting there, uh, uh, lying down, and I'll be like, you know, love you, love you, energy being family, and I'll like lift. I'll put my hand out, right, and then. Um, you know, it'll start to gather around my hand. And it'll start to gather to the point where I'm looking at my fingers and I start to not be able to see my fingers. I start to have to like literally uh, check to see if my fingers are there because I can feel my fingers, but some kind of energy, darker energy with these like little glittery sparkle things is covering up like a portion of my fingers and I can't see my fingers. I can't see like I can see my hand but like a portion of my fingers are gone and I have to literally like check to see if my fingers are there it's the weirdest thing uh, and I've done this multiple is this so this is now t for me every single night you know and like I said during the daytime if, if I'm in a room with some shadow and I want to adjust my consciousness they're there but if it's nighttime and the lights are off I don't even have to adjust my consciousness so there so so what does all that mean so, you know, if you buy what I'm telling you, if, 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 if you believe what I'm telling you, and, and again, I want you to believe, I would love you to believe, because this has nothing to do with just me, it's all of us. This is the, nat this is the natural state of everything. And so when people, when people talk about, oh, uh, search for alien life, and they're coming from there and here, I want to scream at the top of my lungs and go, guys, not only are we not alone, we're surrounded at all times by all these different things, these energy beings and, and, and these light beings and these smoke beings and, and these sparkle lot be, dot, dot beings. And, you know, I don't know where they come from uh, in terms of like where their original origin is, but I know that they're here with us all the time, 24 seven. And guys, when I'm looking at this at night, I'll look and I'll see all these beings, they're everywhere, like all these kind of like, you know, what I, like what I described, they're everywhere. And in between those beings are this purple reddish, it looks like static on it, you know, a snow on a TV, um, you know, the, the white and black snow on a TV, but just imagine that red and purple. There's all of that kind of energy kind of like doing this uh, in between all these beings. And so, I'm so, so, so that, so I'm seeing that every single night. And like I said, so when I lie down on, in the bed and I'm putting my hand out and I'm like, love you energy beings, will you come touch my hand? And they start to manifest literally around my hand, around my fingers, to the point where a portion of my finger I can't see. And it occurred to me last night, I thought, is my f hand disappearing? And I can feel my hand, but no. Uh, the being, whatever being that is, is in front and their mass is so thick and dark that I can literally not see a portion of my fingers. And I can see like the tips of my fingers. And by the way, when I do that, when I hold my hand out and I go, love you energy beings, and they're kind of everywhere and they start to gather around my fingers, I swear to God to you, little sparks of electricity are coming off the tips of my fingers. And I don't know if that's coming from me or them. 
and then and then and then then the mist is everywhere and then that dark sort of energy golden purple whatever it is is in front of my hands and like part of my fingers disappear but I can feel them so what I'm trying to say is, is that we're not alone at all not even close we're surrounded by all of this energy and these beings and 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 when I when I say to them in my head, love you energy beings, come touch my hand, and they start to gather around my hand and, and around my body, like my face, they'll start to kind of multiply like more around my, they're conscious, they hear me. And, and another thing is like, so when I'm doing this, I can literally feel a cool, soft breeze around my fingertips. And I can literally feel, it's almost like a down feather type of softness, like sort of on my skin, and a cool soft breeze. And so I'm seeing all this stuff everywhere. And guys, that, I wasn't seeing this before two months ago. And so what, what I asked them what this all is, because it sort of occurred to me, and so I don't know if they sent it to me, or if I just put it together from being here and experiencing this, but they wanted to teach me, Christopher, it's not about UFOs, we did that to get your attention. Everything is energy and consciousness. That's the physical world that we exist in. There's no difference between the paranormal world and the UFO world. It's all one and the same. We occupy the same space that physical human spirits occupy. You know, so I think at night what I'm seeing is I'm think I asked them that. I said, well, what am I seeing? Am I seeing just human spirits? Am I seeing energy beings? Or they said you're seeing a mixture of both. You're seeing human spirits flying all around. You're seeing our true form of who we are. We're with you. Uh, and I don't know exactly what the smoke mist energy beings are, but, uh, you know, it's been pretty amazing. Uh, all right, I'm going to cut this short and I'm going to do a follow-up video. Okay, I'll, I'll, just because people are walking up and I want to kind of have some privacy. Okay, all right, love you. Bye.